Okay, I'm just gonna make it short and sweet about a response. First off, Merry Christmas to y'all. It's um, December 24. Um, I just saw the 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 review release of Cobal, you know, also known as Loki and Sinji TNA. Um, the last time I responded about Daniel Bryan's release, there was a good reason why. So in this one of um of Cobal, aka Senshi, and Loki of his release. Um, I got not much to say about it, but he is one of my favorite wrestlers, but it just sucks that how he got let go, but he made the decision to leave, to go out of WWE. So, I was no, obviously I know why he he decided to leave because you know that World Wrestling Entertainment they just treated him like a jobber so why the hell he's gonna stay if they're gonna treat him like that you know I mean so far he got a, not, a shot of an Intercontinental title and he had a good matchup with Dolph Ziggler and it was a good matchup but sadly he didn't win the, the IC belt but I applaud for that because that was a good match. You gotta give me, you have to give me that opinion for that because it was a really good ass match. Uh, I forgot what pay per view was of the last one, but if anyone you could comment on that, so I'm like really, I'm like okay, whatever, you know. So yeah, I'm gonna think that I'm gonna be heated with WWE, but nah, I got no heat with them. It's just you know I understand the decision that. That he wants to leave, and a lot of a lot of talents been on and off leaving too, because they had their reasons, and you could understand the decision ways, and also the talents supposedly the corporate decision wise to for them to to keep the talents and to keep them, you know. So regardless of Cabal, it was a huge disappointment that. That he got released and I'm shocked about it but then I kind of know I realize why I'm not going to jump in the conclusion about the whole thing when um, the response of Daniel Bryan being released that was stupid but with look with um, Senshi and Sash Cobal there's a different reason I know because he might end up asking for that release because you know things are not doing you know things he's not happy you know it's nah the way that you know you want to be run as a top star I mean not like a top star or you know great talent you I mean that's top star but great talent I was hoping that he'll make it a top so now Daniel Bryan is the US champ I'm just hoping that they continue to give him a huge push and make the US title very seriously continuing and DiBiase looks most likely to be honest I look like he might win it so uh, I would like to see him win the the, IC, the the U.S. title. I just hopefully that Daniel Bryan after maybe WrestleMania that they, they're going to get drafted to Raw or SmackDown. Most likely I wish he'll go to SmackDown to go for the IC belt unless the IC belt will come to Raw and the United States title going to SmackDown. I'd like to see Daniel Bryan win the IC belt more better than the U.S. title. So a good U.S. champion, a great competitor. But for the record, not a I don't follow of an entertaining thing anymore. It's just too much of that, you know. But um, so basically that's about it about um, Cabal's release. So I kind of say that I knew for a fact that they don't know what to do with him. That should have made him more, more better of a storyline than. Just make a window sign for a couple months being released. Only one shot for the for the Nakano champion and boom, you're gone. Uh, so much for that. And I'm kinda never tell you about the the response about the release all oh, the release several months ago with all sh Chad, um forgot a couple talents that's been released. So I'm kind of new that the tag team division is like really dead already for from WWE. 
So what's up with that? So they they still don't know what they're gonna you know make the tight team division more better and all. So what they got you know. So hopefully to WWE bring the tag team division back and those don't split up tag teams because the Hard Dynasty was the only tag team they have and now you split them up what the hell are you gonna do with them they're not doing shit that's what my opinion they doesn't they're not doing shit so this is all about the uh, it about this um YouTube comment about the release of Cabal and some of the releases of the talents, so like I said, they need to bring the tight team division back. That's all I could just say. So, happy Merry Christmas, and if I got anything to respond, Happy New Year's to, to all. Peace. See you 2011.